Hey, it's Tamer Two Ferns back here with another informative Bob GCC video. I already did a calibration video, but some of you have been having trouble with the uh, bad calibration, so I thought I'd do a little uh, revision of my first version. So we've got our Fob GCC here, it's a nice JP white, some cool bulb buttons. Let's go ahead and plug in. Press B to activate the sticks, and you can see they're working well. So the two main programs we're going to be using today is Smashcope, which we have here, which has lots of really great information baked into the game. We're also going to be using Uncle Punch to try out, which, when set up right, will have a lot of the same information available to you in Smashcope, but you can play the game while you're doing your settings. I'll leave some links in the description. You can find the Smashcope setup on Goomwave's website. It's a self-contained little program that you need to run in a dolphin, mainline dolphin, like Dolphin 5.0. Uncle Punch is a little bit more complicated. You have to convert uh, Melee ISO into training mode Uncle Punch from GitHub here. So why don't we start out in Smash Scope? I take that back. Let's start out with Uncle Punch. I'll show you how to set it up. So once you land on the main page, let's go into the training lab. Pick a character you like and a stage you like. We're going to press start. And in general, turn on the input display. And in the info display, we'll change the preset to ledge. And then change this to the system C stick and the system trigger. So now we have a lot of the same info that's available to us in Smashcope, but we can play while we test. To be safe, let's press Shift F1 save the save state like I've done beforehand. This allows you to return to it from any state within the game, which can be really useful to save having to set up those settings at the top each time. So obviously our sticks, both left and right, are pretty good right now, but why don't we go ahead and mess them up so that uh, we can get a good example here. So I'm going to press A, Z, D-pad up, and B. For uh, A, Z, D pad down, and B. Oh shoot, whoops. I'm going to press A, X, Y, and start to exit safe mode. Then A, Z, D pad down, and B to do a hard reset on the controller. So now you see the sticks are moving up and to the right, and they're not very useful at all. So let's press A, X, Y, and L to start calibration. You can see the C stick return to neutral. That's what we're going to be following along with the left stick here, even though it's not moving on the screen. So it's in neutral position right now, and we will press L or R. It's gone to the right, and we'll press L, return to neutral, up. Return to neutral, left, return to neutral, down, return to neutral, diagonal, neutral, diagonal, neutral, diagonal, neutral, diagonal, neutral. And this is the part where if you have Firefox not notches, you would do those. Um, I don't have them on these controllers today. I will do a video later to go over that. So just, I would recommend clicking through. Once you get to the diagonal up into the top right again, these are notches that we can adjust either clockwise or counterclockwise using X and Y, but we'll skip that for today and just click through those four. So now we've got a working left stick. Let's do the right stick, A, X, Y, and R. Now we're going to be following the left stick, the gray stick here. It won't move around. 
So it's in neutral, press L. Hold the seat stick to the right, press L. Neutral, up, neutral, left, neutral, down, neutral, diagonal, neutral, diagonal, neutral, diagonal, neutral, diagonal, neutral. And this is the spot where uh, if you have notches on your C stick, you would do those, but we definitely don't. So we're just going to skip through the ending here. Sweet, we've got perfect sticks again. So that was calibration in Uncle Punch. Let's jump over to a different program. Opening up Smash Scope, we're going to do a lot of the same thing. We're going to unplug, plug, press B to activate the sticks, and enter into the controller test region with A. So the sticks are good again. Let's mess them up by pressing A, Z, D-pad down, and B to do the hard reset. Oh, whoops, I forgot again. A, X, Y, and start to exit safe mode first. A, Z, D-pad down, and B to do a hard reset on the controller. So now our sticks are all messed up and none of them are working. So what will we do next? We're going to do the exact same as we did in the other program. We're going to press AXY and L to enter calibration of the left stick. You see the C stick center again. Press L and we're hold to the right. Up, neutral, left, neutral, down, neutral, diagonal, neutral, diagonal, neutral, diagonal, neutral. Diagonal neutral. This is the Firefox stick. We will skip over until it's fully completed. Now we have a working stick again. Let's do the same for the C stick. A, X, Y, and R. Then we're going to press R one more time. Move the C stick into the right notch. Press R. Neutral. Up. Neutral. Left, neutral, down, neutral, right, neutral, diagonal up to the left, neutral, down to the left, neutral, down to the left, and skip through the Firefox notches. And we have perfectly working sticks. So the main thing that people usually miss is the neutral step that you have to do between each notch. So you can see on the graphic on the screen, there's a one, which is to the right, two, up, three, left, four, down, five, which is up and to the right, six, up and to the left, seven, down and to the left, eight, down and to the right, and then all of the Firefox notches. Sweet, so that was calibrating Pop GCC in both Smash Scope and Uncle Punch. Uh, if you have any other questions or concerns, definitely leave them in the comments and I'll try and make some, some more videos. Cheers! See ya!